Now we had the chance to speak with Chief Murphy Paul about this shooting and he says that again this was a brazen and targeted attack. A brazen and targeted attack. A brazen and targeted attack. And he also believes that the people responsible are also connected to other acts of violence around the parish. And he now needs your help to offer any type of information to make sure that they can apprehend these people that are responsible so that they can get them off the street before someone else gets hurt. Take a look. A daily and chaotic scene outside the Mall of Louisiana tonight. Two people were killed and two others were sent to a hospital in what Baton Rouge police are calling a planned and targeted attack. I have never seen it like this here before. Theo Jordan is a retired cop and was leaving the mall just moments before the shooting happened. Man, it's just getting crazy where you just can't go nowhere no more unless something like this here happening and everything. I don't know what, what gonna happen in Baton Rouge, you know, in the next few years or so. Police say the suspect spotted the victims in the mall and waited for them to leave before shooting them in broad daylight on a busy road. Investigators say the shooters then hopped in a getaway car and sped off. Chief Murphy Paul says the fact nobody else was hurt was merely luck. Thank God it didn't happen. What I say to the community is help us identify the people. Niggas playing ways to make it. I really feel these niggas faking. They gotta kill me. They won't take these niggas. Won't take my place. I'm too trill. Yeah, too real. Real great nigga. Yeah, something hey, got to be happening, brother. Yeah, they gotta see that. Yeah. Game thought we played. Yeah. It's so game that he can't leave the house. How you ain't got money, but got money on your head. Yeah, yeah man. man. Yeah, Mr. CJ. Hey, man. Bro, what up? Hey, man. What up?